Eating on the run is now more a way of life than it's ever been, even if there's sometimes that touch of guilt because we think packaged food isn't always healthy. Be guilty no more. Our top nutritionists have analysed thousands of brands and have the solution. Laura Sparks reports. This comes out of a packet. Mmm. That is good. It's important to know what you're looking for. Lots of salt. There's no doubt when it comes to food, fresh is best. But as our lives get busier, the convenience of packaged food is quickly becoming a time-saving necessity. But is it healthy? Combining fresh foods with some healthy packaged foods is a good way to be able to you know, eat well and get your nutritional requirements met. There are actually more than 30,000 packaged foods out there, so no wonder when you walk into a supermarket you can go in a bit of analysis paralysis and go a bit crazy because you don't know what to choose. Well, here's a list to help. Women's Health Magazine's 125 Best Packaged Foods. Editor Felicity Percival. We looked at the nutritional content, the fat content, the kilojoule content, the sodium content and the sugar content and threw it all in the mix and, and produced the best ones. Dietitian for Food and Nutrition Australia, Sharon Natoli, analysed the comparisons and compiled the final list. When you're looking at breads and cereals, look for the highest fibre choices and those that are made with whole grains. Whole grains found in tip-top multigrain English muffins. Sharon's choice for their low GI, giving longer-lasting energy. Another favourite, virgin fruit and muesli bread. The fruit acts as an antioxidant. Cereals? Uncle Toby's shredded wheat, it's just that, whole wheat, nothing is added. Or oats fitness, with added calcium and fibre, the very best for breakfast. And my pick for cereal and bread is the Carmen's Natural Muesli because it's made from 100% whole natural ingredients, so your oats, your dried fruit, your nuts and seeds. And with the Bergen Soy and Seed Bread, it's a good source of omega-3, it's very high in fibre and it's made from lots of whole grains. For even more fibre, try whole meal pastas. One serve is half your daily needs. As for those once in a while treats... When it comes to chocolate, look for an 85% cocoa chocolate. It's giving you plenty of antioxidants and we know the fat in chocolate doesn't affect your cholesterol level as much as other types of fats. When it comes to savoury snacks, nuts are a great choice. Um, they're high in fibre and giving you some healthy fat. So these are particularly good because they come in convenient single serves. When it comes to soups, Sharon is convinced Country Cup whole grain noodles is the best cup of soup on the market. Not just because of its whole grains, but it's also lower on salt. Tinned soup? Try Heinz sweet potato and pumpkin. 58% veggies with no added colours, flavours or preservatives. But Vellish soup tops that with 68% veggies. Salmon is actually a better choice than tuna because of its high omega-3 content. Omega-3 fats are great for a healthy heart, brain and eye functioning. Even some TV dinners are on the list. When it comes to frozen meals, look for those that are lower in sodium and lower in saturated fat and have got lots of vegetables in them. The healthy choice and lean cuisine ranges are an okay once in a while option. Just watch the sources, but here is the very best packaged meal combination. Frozen vegetables are great, they're just vegetables and they're um, snap frozen so they retain their nutritional value, pretty much equivalent to fresh vegetables. And then a whole piece of salmon that's been frozen is also a great choice. So put these two together and you've got a quick and you know, a healthy meal in minutes. And the full list of 125 foods is in Women's Health magazine.